Porsche now considers all suspension hardware to be single-use only and recommends the replacement of all nuts and bolts. The lower control arms on the 991 Gen 1 have been redesigned are now referred to as wishbone arms due to their distinct shape. They have also eliminated the ball joint and it only has one bushing. The wishbone arm, red arrow, connects to the subframe, blue arrows. Begin by safely raising and supporting your vehicle. The camber of the rear wheel carrier is set by the eccentric nut, bolt, and washers on the subframe side, red arrow. The wishbone side connects to the wheel carrier and splits the rear shock, blue arrow. The wishbone needs to be removed from the wheel carrier to access the rear shock. Replacing or removing the wishbone from the subframe will necessitate in getting the alignment redone. While you want to replace a nut and bolt, you want to mark the concentric washer in several places so you can at least get the alignment close enough to safely drive the vehicle to an alignment shop. Make sure to mark both washers. Use an 18 and 19 millimeter wrench and loosen the nut, green arrow, and bolt, red arrow. Use a 16 millimeter and 18 millimeter wrench and remove the nut, blue arrow, and bolt, red arrow. Swing the arm down and then remove the hardware from the cross member. Make sure to transfer over the markings on the old washers to the new ones or reuse the old washers to get the alignment close. The wishbone only has a bushing where it connects to the cross member, red arrow, where it connects to the wheel carrier is solid. If you are replacing the wishbone because of slop in the suspension, make sure to check the conditions of the bushings in the wheel carrier indicated by the red arrow. These wear out and can be a source of sloppy handling. Installation is the reverse of removal. Make sure the suspension is level to the ground when torquing and get the alignment done as soon as possible. Torque the wheel carrier to wishbone hardware to 90 Newton meters or 67 foot pounds and then an additional 90 degrees. Torque the cross member to wishbone hardware to 100 Newton meters or 73 foot pounds. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.